Hi guys, oh, welcome back to another video. <laughs> we got some more junk that we need to talk about, some more stuff that we ordered. Let's jump right into it. The first thing is actually new and it's from Target, some body care. You all know that I'm in love with their beloved um, lotion and spray line. So this one is called Peach Prosecco and Mimosa Flower. And I picked up the body mist along with the vegan body cream. So it's the spray and the cream. And when I tell y'all, this smells amazing. It puts you in a mind if you used to wear peach bellini from Bath and Body Works. That's what it puts me in the mind of. But it smells just like sweet peaches. Another reason why I love this brand is because it lasts all day on your skin and it makes your skin really, really soft. So that's a bonus for me. It's more than just the smell. Like it makes your skin really, really small. I'm not sure how new this is, but yeah, they were each $9.99 and it's a Target brand. Uh, I got some stuff from Amazon, some stuff from Ulta. Let's go ahead and do the Amazon stuff first. So you all know I've been saying for at least three or four months that I needed a new electric pencil sharpener for my eyeliners or maybe my lip liner. So I picked this one up from Amazon. <laughs> oh my goodness, from Amazon for $8.99. So now I have me a electric pencil sharpener, which I needed. The other things I picked up from Amazon was beauty supply store stuff. Stuff that you can normally find in a beauty supply store. But um, they, I was on Amazon 3 o'clock in the morning and saw it and I was like, okay. The first thing are these Ruby Kisses eyebrow pencils. So I picked one, I picked one up in black brown and the other up in dark brown, right? Let me move up. Oh, wow, I'm so far back. Okay, so one in black brown and one in dark brown, and they are they come in a set of three. So I got three pencils for two dollars. So I paid four dollars for six pencils. And that's what I used on my eyebrows today. I watch a young lady, her name is Keita Beauty here on YouTube. And she always uses on her clients, but I could never find it in my beauty supply store. So something said, well, go on Amazon, because y'all know I'm on my eyebrow kick and I be trying to do eyebrows now. So these are amazing. I think this beat out my um, Precisely My Brow by Benefits, the one that's $23. Because I use this today and I'm liking it so far. The next thing I picked up was this Ruby Kisses Set and Forget Setting, 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 Setting Powder, 16 hours. Uh, this is in the shade Earth. And it's, it's that banana rich shade that y'all know I'm obsessed with. And the reason why I picked up these, um, products is because I wanted to do a beauty supply store or total full face of beauty supply store stuff. So I picked up another matte Ruby Kisses powder and this one is in, is in the shade 12. You all know last week I picked up the shade Honey Brown and I felt like that was a little bit too dark for me. I could still make it work though. But this is the shade Caramel and Caramel is looking uh, <laughs> too light. So I'm afraid that they do not have a shade for my complexion that is like spot on. So I can swatch this. Yeah, this is going to have to be a hot, although it might because the honey brown to me felt like it oxidized. So maybe this will oxidize, but I don't think so. Y'all see how light that is? And I also picked up a poreless face primer by Ruby Kisses. This was one of the 
first things that I started using when I really, really got into makeup and Ruby Kisses had like the poreless primer, a primer for redness and they got like another one and I used to buy those like crazy. So Amazon had this and I think it was like $4.99 or something. So yeah, so these are the products that I have so far working toward my uh, beauty supply store full face. The next thing, well, I got one thing. I already did a video on it. It's the e.l.f. Halo Glow Liquid Filter. Uh, I want it. It's not a foundation. I don't know what it is. It's just, it's just, it just says liquid filter. And this is in the shade 6. I have a video already on my channel reviewing this and wear tests and all that good stuff. But, yeah, I picked this up from the Wealth e.l.f. website, and it was $14. The next things I picked up were from Ulta during their lip sale. The items I got was buy one, get one, 50% off. So all of these items were on either on sale or clearance or whatever. It was like their lip, whatever. The first thing I got wasn't part of the lip thing. It's the new ColourPop Color Shock um, bronzers. Super, super shock bronzer. And I got the shade Dream Vacay. And it was $8. Yeah, I know I love a good bronzer these days. And I started, I think it's one shade deeper than this. And I started to get it. But I'm like, mm. yeah, I know I've been into like that not so deep bronze look if you know super shock stuff then you know that it feels whippy it's really whippy but this is how the color looks so hopefully yeah it look like it show up on me i wonder if you can see yeah so it's gonna give me that brown contour bronze look versus that deep one that I'm used to doing that I'm trying to get out of doing mm -hmm. and the next things are let me wipe this off my finger are lip products I'm gonna go ahead and do the lipsticks first because these were on sale well all of them was on sale but these were five dollars and I picked up two of the morphe matte lipstick one is in the shade steamy and one is in the shade dominate and of course they are red shades I don't need another red shade but anyway so this is a dominate and if you know morphe lipsticks you know they're really good they're really matte and I love a red lip but I like it to be blue based I love blue based red and this right here already puts me in the mind of Ruby Roo for five dollars uh, Ruby Roo excellent uh, a very legendary lipstick one that will stand the test of time but Ruby Roo is dry Okay, and this is steamy from Morphe. Ruby Root is dry. You have to put, make sure you moisturize your lips before you put on Ruby Root. So this is steamy. I think steamy is more orange red, like orange red than red. You know what I mean? I'll be back to see. Right now, I can't tell. But yeah, you can see the difference. So the one on the outside is steamy, on the inside is dominate. They're both pretty. And for $5, I got my reds set for the fall. So red lipsticks are together. Okay, next we can do the things that aren't in a box. So the first one is a lip liner all of these are lip liners so all the last items are lip liners and it's by essence stay eight hour lip liner waterproof with sharpener and this is in the shade famous and it looks like this let's go ahead and swatch it I'm gonna swatch it right here it's like a plummy shade. Yeah, this is a plum. By the top, you would think it would be like a reddish brown. But to me, it's pulling more like a plum. You see it? Like a plum shade. 
which I'm not mad at. The next three are uh, LA Girl Shock Wave Lip Liners, and I picked up three of them. One is in the shade Sandstorm, which is a new shade. I figure I can always fill in. Maybe I should show y'all the top. I could fill in my lips with this. The next one is Chai Latte. Y'all know I always have to get something with latte in it. Everything I got named latte. <laughs> and it's like a brown shade, but not a very deep brown shade. And the last one is rosewood which i don't know y'all know i always i tell y'all this all the time i'm always picking up this mauvey colors and i don't know why so let's see what we got going on okay so we have Rosewood, Chai Latte, and Sandstorm. If you can see. Let me do Sandstorm because I think I'm going to do Sandstorm because I had that bronzer right there. So I'm going to do Sandstorm on the other side. Okay. So Rosewood, the brown is uh, Chai Latte, and then Sandstorm is <laughs> Focus. Sandstorm is over here, which is a nude shade, which I'm going to have to put in the middle of something because um, I can't use that for a liner. I got gloss on, so it's not going to... It got nothing to do. But it's, it would be perfect for a uh, um, filling, to fill in your lips with or whatever. down I did pick up two multi sticks from wet and wow I have been on purple I've been loving everything purple and I picked up the shade royal scam which is a very deep purple shade and also a lilac shade purple which is a Lavender Bliss. Let's go ahead and swatch this. You know, I used to have one, oh yes, that I used to contour with. I don't know where it's at though. Oh my gosh, these are beautiful. So there you go. Those are beautiful. Royal Scam is a deep one, and then Lavender Bliss is the lilac one. But just looking at these right now, I feel like they will be really good when I get ready to use my Juvia's Garden of Juvia's palette as a base, especially for that purple shade. So we might revisit and try that. The next ones or the last things are lip liners mostly browns. I picked up a black opal precision lip liner in the shade, I don't know, wood line. I didn't know black opal made lip liners, but I'm glad they do. So let's see. Looks like this. Let's see how deep this brown is. Put it on my wrist. Oh, wow. It's more of a plump. It's almost borderline night moth. Almost borderline night moth. If you can see, let me focus it on it. So you see it? It's almost <laughs> night moth, but still beautiful. Still beautiful. Okay. The next one is a lip pencil from Milani Lip Liner in the shade Rich Cocoa 180. I should never have to buy another lip liner this year, next year, the year after, the year in between. I don't need no more lip liners. Y'all know this is a brown, but let's see. Oh, it was looking like it wanted to come out. This is a pretty brown. 
This is a rich cocoa for Milani. <laughs> my camera's like, girl, what are you doing? Well, let me focus it on my arm. So, rich cocoa. It's a brown shade. I ain't mad at it at all. Not at all. The next one is a lip liner from Jacqueline Hill in the shade Bold Brew. I love Jacqueline Hill eyeshadow palettes. Never had any other product from her. So let's see. It's a brown. It's a brown. Do this on the front on my arm. Oh, it's a pretty brown. Okay. <laughs> That's a pretty brown. Front of my arm. Y'all see it? That's a pretty brown. Uh huh. Oh, that's pretty. That's pretty. And the last two are from Smashbox. Another one I did not know made lip liner. Be Legendaries. Uh, lime and Prime pencils. I picked one up in the shade dark brown and one in dark British brown. So this is how the boxes are looking. These were $10. So they weren't part of the buy one, get one 50% off. Let's do the first one. The first one, this is the dark brown. I'll put it right next to the Jaclyn Hill so you can see. So this is the dark brown right here. By Smashbox, the second one. It's not real dark, but I like that. I like that. And then the next one is a dark reddish brown. That's pretty awesome. Alright, I I won with this. I won with this. It's different. Come on. Why did I go way over there with the swatch? <laughs> But yeah, so now you see that reddish brown. That's pretty also. So let's just say I wanted to do a red lip, but didn't want to, you know, do a brown lip liner. I could do this, you know, just so your lipstick doesn't look like it's going out of the line of your lip, you know. Yeah, I like that. But these are all the swatches. I'll list the products below in the description box it's me trying to make sure <laughs> y'all see everything yeah that's all guys that's all we got today we'll be back with another haul y'all know how we do we'll be back with another haul pretty soon if you have if you brought anything during the ulta lip sale drop down of course and let me know what you purchased and if you're satisfied with your purchase always let me know and I'm going to put this stuff up. I'm going to put it up. I'm going to be organized. And I'll see you all in my next video. Bye, guys.